We provide a generous three-day supply of food, sized to suit the family that comes in. When somebody comes, comes for help, we'll refer them to one of the 65 aid agencies in the town that can refer people to us to receive food. They will tell us what the problem is, where the people are living, what size the family is. They'll bring that voucher back to us. We will then make up a food parcel specifically for them that will cover the needs of their family. We've also added to that uh, some of the basic necessities of life, things like toilet rolls, toiletries, sanitary products, things that we don't even think about normally. But if you can't afford food, you can't afford those either. Okay, so in a general day-to-day -day week, do you get enough food? No, we don't. Um, we get generous donations from the churches and from various organisations around the town, including some of the companies in the town. But it doesn't actually meet the need of the people who come into us for food. We really rely on these supermarket collections about once every quarter to allow us to top up our warehouse so that we can actually provide what people need. If they could go into Tesco, pick up a, a shopping list from one of our volunteers who are, who are in the foyer, take that into the store, buy one or two or three or four, whatever they can afford items from that list, and then deposit it into the collection baskets on the foyer as they leave the store, we can then use that to help feed people who cannot feed themselves and their families at the moment.